when you watch these interrogation videos and you see the way that they're treating these people, mostly women, um, yeah, it, it, I did think to myself, I mean, you could just phone this in, like you could just label it unfounded and move on. I don't know why you're not doing that. Cause now you have to go sometimes to court and show up for the trial. And you know, like it's a lot of yeah. taxpayer dollars if we just want to pragmatically <laughs> focus on that. So the fact that they focus on punishing them, I don't know. It's, I think that police get angry when they feel like someone's lying to them. I think they, they want to make an example of people. And I also think they know that the public's going to eat it up. I mean, when it is posted on their Facebook page or local news picks it up, the public is very grateful for their service. They're grateful they caught a liar. Um, so it, it it's it a works. witch hunt. Yeah, it works in the same system. It feeds itself like it just. I think it works out in their favor usually. 